had everything i had job family but i was uh, feeling little bored in life there was some kind of a vacuum whatever i do i was unable to fill that vacuum so when i tried uh, for the first time i kind of felt like some kind of satisfaction in me i thought like okay this is kind of like fulfilling whatever vacuum that i have then i thought okay meditation is something that i really need in my life everybody should learn it so you have to let go and just sit peacefully yeah. whatever happens happens and then you sleep go to sleep if you can meditate just meditate i need not chase anybody i need not run for my business i need not take everything that comes to me okay? all the negative scenarios just push them aside focus on just what you want and you'll get it in life absolutely great Hello masters namaste this is Arun Aladar come again uh, from Atlanta Georgia today we have very very special guest uh, you know he's been backbone for many of uh, the pssm activities not just that uh, he is the brain child of many activities he is a master of uh, action i would say so let us learn more about uh, pavan posarla today and uh, understand his experiences and uh, his activities uh, yeah. namaste pavan Hi, namaste, Arj. Yeah, thank you so much for uh, allowing us to do <laughs> this meditation uh, experience sharing. So, tell us briefly about yourself. So, hi, I'm Pavan Pusarla. So, actually, uh, I work as an IT professional, and I'm also an entrepreneur. I run uh, two staffing companies. So, we have around seventy people uh, currently working, and we have lot more on bench. so that's about my background like um, i started my company like 11 years ago and i slowly grew it uh, to this size so i'm happy with what i have so okay. family background my wife is uh, pravalika and i have uh, two children uh, jyotha pranavi and uh, onish gupta so both of them were born through water birth so i heard for the first time uh, about what about from uh, dr newton so you understand uh, meditation right like why do we need to do meditation and uh, who helped you to get into this practice of meditation okay so initially actually um, i was uh, feeling little bored in life and uh, i had some kind of void in my life there was some kind of a vacuum so whatever i do i was unable to fill that vacuum so i had everything i had job family everything but uh, somehow i had felt like a little vacuum always so once uh, i met uh, shrikant through divya actually so divya was a friend uh, actually divya nadimpalli yeah divya nadimpalli's oh. husband actually and uh, kanishka okay. and me we were uh, school classmates Oh okay okay yeah so that's how uh, i met divya and divya said uh, there is a meditation event going on in uh, suvani at srikant's house so that's when i thought okay why not uh, let let me give it a try oh okay okay yeah so when i tried uh, for the first time i i i kind of felt like some kind of satisfaction in me i thought like okay this is kind of like fulfilling whatever vacuum that i have Oh okay okay so then uh, they said uh, we have to do for 41 days and also i i did the complete 41 days meditation so you attended continuously for throughout the 41 days yes oh, okay. yeah okay yeah so then i thought okay meditation is something that i really need in my life okay was it in person some in person and uh, some we did at home actually oh okay okay so there yeah. was online session by then itself okay not online but we did it ourselves oh, for 41 okay. days uh-huh. Uh-huh. some days i attended in between the in person session but the other days we did at home actually oh, okay. so it needs lot of motivation to do it at home <laughs> yes <laughs> in yes. that in the early days right yes yeah. yes yeah so, so yeah, yeah. So I, we felt good actually. Me and my wife uh, Pravlika, we both of us did it, and we felt like it was a good experience. When was this actually? One In two thousand fifteen. Two thousand fifteen. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So once we did the forty one meditation, we were completely into it. So I thought we thought like this is must. Everybody should learn it, mm-hmm. and uh, whatever uh, we have to do to spread it. whatever we have to do to help others achieve the same kind of satisfaction or happiness or whatever you call 
I thought like we have to spread it and whatever effort I can I can do I wanted to do it myself. So oh. until we had kids, actually uh, we were actively participating in all PSSM uh, USA activities. Yeah. After uh, we had kids and uh, maybe after they grew up, uh, I was little. Uh, yeah. I took a back step and uh, kind of in the <laughs> watching you and uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, absolutely yeah. needed. Like we need yeah. to give time to kids. Yes. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. Uh, tell us uh, some good experiences or the best experience that you feel like uh, during meditation. Do, do you have anything as such? Personally, I never had any kind of experiences in meditation. All I see is a blank. Mm -hmm. Whenever I close my eyes, it's all blank for me. Yeah. Never experienced anything. It's so basically, like, um, um, I mean, most of the people think that uh, if um, you, there, there has to be something visually, we have to see or something like that, right? Like, it's not exactly the experience means like experience is anything like even we feel complete calmness, complete blank mind so that like once we are done with the meditation, we feel very fresh, yeah. right? Like we will start a uh, day better, mm -hmm. you know, like all these things are a kind of experiences. So you have anything like that? So my experience is primarily always, almost always, every time I do, it's always blank. Mm -hmm. Just a calm and a peaceful state of mind. Yeah, That's so it. that itself is an experience. Exactly, yeah. exactly. Yeah. yes. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. So you always had that uh, kind of experience. Yes. Like, you know, okay, yeah, yeah that, that's what I wanted to <laughs> Because like most of the people have this uh, thing, right? Like uh, we have to see something only then we call it yeah. as an experience, right? Yeah. Like we have to take away... Or uh, we have to uh, com completely understand that anything is an experience. Yes. Uh, attend attempting that uh, calmness itself is an experience. Yeah. Sort of feel. So, so we in, have to yeah. do it without expecting anything. Yes. So you you need to have like zero expectations. Yes. Whenever you think that uh, you want to see something, that will keep running in your mind. So your logical mind is always on during the meditation. Absolutely. Chasing yeah. for that expectation to meet that expectation. So you have to let go and just sit peacefully. Yeah. Yeah. Whatever happens, happens. Whether you sleep, go to sleep. If you can meditate, just meditate. That's absolutely what? a great point from yeah. you. So, uh, so like soon after you continue doing the meditation, right? Like what are the experience, I mean, not experience, but what are the changes that you observed in yourself? Uh, I mean, uh, you before meditation, you have a situation and you have reacted in a different way. And after practicing of meditation, like, did you observe any changes in yourself, like in responding to the things? Yes. Like, yes. can you please share any example yeah. of? Such? Yes. A lot of changes actually. So before meditation, uh, I always used to react. So after meditation, I learned to respond, not to react. So situations always happen all the time. So instead of reacting, we respond with our own self, like awareness, being aware. So what you speak, what you think what you eat, everything has changed after uh, I did the meditation, actually. Okay. okay. So in, any such example, like if you want to share with the audience. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So before meditation, right, I never knew uh, there are like these three different types of thinking, positive, negative, miraculous thinking, right? So just go with the flow is what it used to be before meditation. But after meditation, I became very conscious of what to think because uh, law of attraction is what I learned in meditation. So what law of attraction says is that you always focus on what you want. Don't focus on what you don't want. Right. So that has yielded me a lot of uh, good results actually. So whenever I think something, whenever I, uh, whenever I put my heart and soul and uh, wish for something, it used to get manifested very easily. Okay. So, um, does that help in your uh, in in career growth or anything as such? Yes. Uh, like the yes. way you think. Yes. Yeah. So it helped a lot in my business actually. Okay. 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 So I came to a conclusion after meditation that there is abundance for everybody. Okay. All you need to do is wish for what you want. Everything will come to you. I need not chase anybody. I need not run for my business. I need not take everything that comes to me. Right? I can only wish for exactly what I want. I'll get exactly what I want. 
absolutely great great <laughs> insights on uh, yeah. meditation and its benefits right yeah. so uh, i mean in order to uh, uh, yeah did you be, you got some benefits with the meditation really like how do you want to take this meditation forward like what are the things that you have in your mind to take this meditation uh, to your friends or to the community like what are your thoughts on it uh we need to strike a chord with the audience like what exactly they are looking for we need to give that instead of giving what we have we need to <coughs> sugar coat it in a way to present it to them so that they will get attracted to it so that they will get uh, the benefits of exactly. it exactly yeah. yeah they will get attracted to it and they will start using meditation in their own life and they will experience uh, the benefits yeah. of meditation it's always uh, whatever we got it it shouldn't be the same for the other people right exactly. like they'll have a different uh, way of looking at it a different yeah. perceptions on the meditation yes. yeah absolutely like what yeah. the only thing that we can take is uh, the process of meditation how do we do that that's yes. it that's the only thing that we can yeah. uh, take it forward do you have any message that you want to give to pmc viewers uh, as part of a, 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 it could be a suggestion it could be a message that you want to give to the global audience okay uh, there is abundance in the universe okay so just wish for what you want always and you'll get it no second thoughts don't think about everything around that that will not happen all the negative scenarios just push them aside focus on just what you want and you'll get it in life whether it is money whether it is love whether it is life whether it is career whatever it is just focus on what you want and you'll get it awesome awesome wonderfully <laughs> quoted thank you so much uh, for sharing all your thoughts today with us uh, so friends uh, that's about it thank you so much for watching us please do like share subscribe and uh, uh, follow us on instagram and facebook thank you so much